Hi, this is Abhilash and welcome to your first Metro CSS tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create a button. A button in Metro CSS looks something like this. So we will start. Here are two files, one is HTML and one is a CSS file. Uh, here I have imported the CSS. And we will start by creating a new class, button. I am giving the name button, but you can give any name. We will set the border to none because we don't need any border and display property to inline block. We'll set the padding to 10 pixel and margin also 10 pixel. Now we'll set the dimension of the button height 50 pixel and width 150 pixel. Now we'll set the background color. There is a cool website named HTMLcolorcodes.info from which you can generate your own HTML color. Just slide the circle in the box and the code will be displayed in the box, small box below. Let's copy this code and paste it. Now we'll add color to the text. I'm using white. Now we'll set the text decoration to none because only plain text will be displayed in the button without decoration. We'll set the text alignment to center. And font family to CJOLI. This is the font style of the text. And font size to 20 pt. Now we will add an effect there. Class name. Hover. Background color. I'm using black. This means whenever we will hover our mouse on the button, the button will change its background color to black. Now let's come to the HTML part. We will add the div tag and the class. We'll add some text there. Let's check it. You can see it works and looks good. Now let's add a link there. This will direct to google.com. Let's check it. You can see there is a hyperlink there. Now let's change the style of this link. Here. And we'll set the text decoration to none, which will wipe out the underline from the hyperlink. And set the color to white, which will change the blue color of the hyperlink to white. Now let's save it and check it. You can see it works and redirects to google.com. So thank you for watching guys. See you in the next tutorial.